Hello everyone, my name is VHS Van, whichever you'd like to call me, and today I thought I'd like to do something new on the channel. I want to try out doing a horror game, and I was thinking, do I want to do Friday the 13th or just something else? Originally I recorded some, I recorded a game called Never Ending Nightmares, but the audio was horrible. It was just plain awful. You couldn't hear me. Well, you could at times, but not really. It, it's just awful. Now that I'm back with my normal setup, I should be able to record these videos just fine. So again, want to try something new. So today we're playing Amnesia The Dark Descent. And before we get started, I just wanted to say I'm not done making normal horror videos, the podcast, none of that stuff. This isn't a gaming channel. I just wanted to try something new and see how it goes. So just put the music back up a bit. And we'll get started. Uh, five. We'll see how that sounds when we get into the game. Start a new game, yes. I've owned these games since 2015. I've never actually played them. Right now is I go from one room, I go pick up a letter don't or forget. something from Alexander. I don't know. I must be forgotten. The shadow hunting me. I must hurry. My name is Daniel. I live in London at, at uh, Mayfair. At what Mayfair. This is crazy. Mm -hmm. Don't forget. Mm -hmm. Don't forget. I must stop him. Focus. Whoa, it's My really name dark. Is, is Daniel. I am Daniel. I am Daniel. Wait, what did E do? Oh wow, it's really dark. I do something, or was that just the game transitioning to the next scene? No, we transitioned. Something I'd like to play is Fahrenheit Indigo Prophecy. That's one of my favorite games, actually. But, uh, there's this glitch where I could not pass the asylum level because Carla, or whatever her name was, she can only turn one way and you die going that way. So when you restart, Carla is also facing a different angle. So let's say she's supposed to be looking forward like this. She's forward like this. So when you walk, you inevitably like you hit a you hit a wall. Like you won't win. You'll die. And I need matches. Are there were um Oh. Oh, I don't have any tinder boxes. Oh. Okay. So were there any boxes in here? I don't know. Just look at the look at the lights. There we go. That doesn't help. Oh. Oh, here we go. Supposed to follow the rose petal? It ends here. Oh, here's some. Is this oil? Oh, tinderbox. Uh, okay. So, I believe this here is just a closet. Or is it this room? Am I not even in the area I think I'm in right now? And I remember watching PewDiePie play this once. I didn't watch a whole lot of his gameplay because I wasn't into this game at all. I remember when I bought this back in 2014, before I even started my channel, I was like, yeah, this is how PewDiePie got big, this is how I'll get big. <laughs> oh, shit. But I think this could be a fun game. I assume it has a story to it, why wouldn't it? So I assume it'll be a good game. And do I have to go through here? Tinder boxes are used to light, blah, blah, blah. Okay, let's do one of these. Oh, maybe there's a secret passage in here that I need to light up. Or maybe I need to open up this door. Okay. Oh, here we are. Oh, it's dark. Wait a minute, I have an idea. Oh, door shut behind me. That's kind of creepy. I assume that's what happened, because all I heard was a door creak. I hope... But I, say, I hope nothing's following me. And I'm not one of the YouTubers who fake stuff, and I'm not 
say I'm not trying to say anyone fake stuff, but I mean, come on. But I'm not a YouTuber who fakes reactions or anything, so I won't be going, oh no, something, oh, I thought I seen something, or anything like that. Can I pick this up? That was a waste. Oh, crap. Was I down here? Or is this blocked off? This is blocked off. Whoa, is this a tunnel? No. It's a nice looking game. I want to play a machine for pigs. Uh, I think that's a sequel or a prequel or something. I don't know. It's it's something to Amnesia. I just assume it'll be interesting because it's called a machine for pigs. I'm just gonna shut this because even though I know nothing's gonna happen right now, it's still kind of creepy. And I don't believe you find any monsters until well further on in the game. But it's just still creepy, you know? Because it's different playing a game and then watching a movie. Because watching a movie... Oh shit, do you hear that? That's not a fake reaction. I was being serious. I just heard that. So, I don't know if that was uh, Daniel walking or not, but I heard something walk. Running or something. Okay. That's a little creepy. Um, light. I, I need light something on fire. I need to turn on a light. I didn't do anything, but at least Daniel stood up. This is an area that always creeped me out because when I was first playing it, I was like, oh shit, this is such a big area. Something could come out of anywhere. Oh, okay. Anyway, something come, could come out of anywhere. Oh, something could pop out of this. Daniel, don't breathe. That. Oh, that kind of creeped me out right then. Oh yeah, the lights go out in this room. Be aware, when standing in darkness, your sanity slowly drains. So do you die from low sanity, or do you just... Does negative effects happen to you? Like less stamina or something. Are these rose petals? Because these aren't good at all. Where's the... up there? Old archives. I'm not really a tryhard like I was when I was younger playing games. Can I light this on fire? No, I remember trying this before. Now, if I was just doing a YouTube video for fun, just to be a, I don't know, whatever, I'd be like, oh, this is my book. It's Mr. Book. This is my best friend, and we'll do all sorts of cool stuff. But, okay, I need the lamp. Oh, shit, it's dark. I don't know if I'm yelling to you guys, but the audio is loud for me. Oh, my gosh. I know nothing's gonna happen yet, but it's still so creepy. Oh, just pick up the lamp! Idiot, thank you. Now, please, everything stop for a minute. <laughs> oh, gosh. Oh. Open. Open Sesame. Open. See, I'm doing YouTube shit now. I'm just being stupid. Open! That. Oh, I hear something. Uh, do I need to open up inventory and do that? I need to add it in. Whoa. This menu looks really different. Oh, uh, when a game, when in game, press F or F button X. Oh, no. Nothing is down there. Oh, I don't remember if there is or not. I didn't go this way. Oh! Okay. I'm... I don't really want to keep playing. Because I... Ah, I'll get jump scared and I'll... Ah, 
It'll get me like a. There we go. Alexander's note, I think. 19th of August, 1839. I wish I could ask how much you remember. I don't know if there'll be anything left. After oh, Daniels. This drink. Who's Alexander? Why do I keep saying Daniel. that? I can't tell you why, but know this. I choose to forget. Try to find comfort and strength in that fact. There is a purpose. You are my final effort to put things right. God willing, the name Alexander of Brennan oh, there you go. still Alexander. bitter anger in you. If not, this will sound horrible. Go to the inner sanctum, find Alexander, and kill him. His body is old and weak, and yours, young and strong. He will be no match for you. One last thing. A shadow is following you. It's a living nightmare, breaking down reality. I have tried everything, and there is no way to fight back. You need to escape it as long as you can. Redeem us both, Daniel. Descend into the darkness where Alexander waits and murder him. Your former self, Daniel. So I must have wrote that note a long time ago. I remember just setting it here because you could pick up everything and just throwing around bottles. Oh, can't pick up everything, but almost everything. Cause I just love physics games where like there's actual physics and shit. Just pick that up. Oh, just drop it. Oh, spilled some. Or it could be blood. I'll, I choose to believe I spilled some. Hey, look at that. The book on Skyrim. And, uh, yeah. I don't remember what happens after this. Ah. Uh, I hate that I don't know. Oh, crap. I don't have any more oil things. Feel free to shut. Ah, I don't know what happens next. I don't like that. You see, in horror movies that I've already watched that I review, I'm like, okay, I know what's going to happen. I can commentate over it. This isn't so much the situation with this. I don't care about commentating over it. What I care about is not getting jump scared like a... Oh, there you go. I'm out of oil. You know what? <laughs> I think I'm going to end this video here. Can I save from here? Um... Yeah, save and exit. So, guys, um, if you want more, make sure to let me know. I will do more. And I wasn't trying to sound fake. I hope nothing I said sounded fake. Because those few times when I was like, oh, this is creepy, I really meant it. Some stuff was creepy. But, yeah, I'm not going to give fake screams or something. Usually when I get scared and I jump, I jump. I don't scream. So, yeah. <laughs> but anyway, thank you for watching. Uh, this is just something new I was testing out. If you want more, make sure to let me know in the comments. I'm not asking for likes. Just comment down below. Just say yes or no or whatever. And yeah, thank you for watching. I'll see you in the next one.